My name is Phil, I'm just Phil. Quiet on the set, please. Hello, good morning, or afternoon, or evening for you. I'm back in I'm back in the groove. I feel it. I feel like making videos. I'm excited. Although I've been feeling like making videos. I just I had a couple of work days where I was working background. So I couldn't upload. I uploaded on Monday. I missed Thursday. Today is Friday. But whatever. I'm going to usually my upload dates are Mondays and Thursdays. But uh, I don't really care for the schedule at the moment. I just want to make sure I'm staying staying relatively consistent. And then we'll get back to a proper schedule eventually. But firstly, I do want to say that right now, currently in the world, last week, uh, Russia has been invading Ukraine. I don't really talk about anything political, although I don't really consider war. Well, war, I guess, is political in a way, in a lot of ways. But I don't talk about world issues like COVID-19. When it was all happening, I, I barely spoke about it. I kind of just... I'm, I'm a very insular person. I think about myself in a selfish way. And also just, that's what I'm good at is people and emotions and politics and business and economy is not my strong suit. And these last couple of years, I've gotten more and more involved and more more listening. But, uh, but I still don't feel it. It's not for me to talk about. And, you know, everyone's talking about it and everyone has an opinion, so... There's got to be some of us who don't talk about it and don't have too much of an opinion and just listen and observe. While I'm on the point, it feels like everyone is so angry and upset in the world, not related to the war right now, but yeah, we do need people that are in the middle that are listening to both sides and not getting up in arms and angry. And that's what I feel like I need to do right now in these times. But in terms of the war, I don't think anyone can... I think every regular person in the world is just like, what? why? This is dumb, senseless, it's stupid. No one wants war, no one wants death. It's on either side. No one's... No one deserves to die. But yeah, I just... I, I, I feel the need to... Because I don't talk about it at all, I just want you to know that I, I see what's going on and I try and absorb it and think about it. But again, I'm not very actively... And a person, like, I think you know that already by now. And now we'll try and transition into me making the album after all that. So a couple days ago, I got the drums from my cousin, and I haven't been able to work on it much, but I imported the drums into the projects. And I've been deciding, I've been like, okay, now I have three songs with drum track recordings from my cousin. So I technically could finish those three songs up. But I also have other songs that I'm working on, and I could be working on those ones, and getting those ready to send to my cousin also. So I've made the decision. I'm going to focus in on one song, the first song, Cool. I've chosen the drum track, so I had like about four takes to go through and choose my favorite parts and put it all in there. And it sounds great. It sounds really great. And now I'm going to record final vocals today. Final lead guitar as well. Whether I do it all today or not, depends. And then backing vocals as well. So I'm basically going to do all final recordings so I have nothing else to do. All minor edits. Again, not all today. Over the next couple of days. And then start, start to mix it. And this song should be done. Like I could technically finish this song in a couple of days. <laughs> Won't change my plans And I put my heart and thoughts out there Never been smooth Or run a swimming I know it's no secret I want you so bad 
Don't make it easy I won't change my plans And put my heart and thoughts out there Or run a zoom in So I just finished recording the lead vocals, um, backing vocals. I'm not going to be doing too much of those, but I'm going, but I might record that later today. But for now, I'm just chilling out for a second because after doing vocals, it kind of like takes a lot out of you. So I'm like thinking a lot and like trying to sing everything properly and re-recording things. So I'm just chilling out. I'm going to make a tea, and then listen over to those vocals and take the best takes and chop it all up. I'm gonna do that now because it's better to do it while it's fresh in my mind and I remember things instead of waiting a couple of days and then I'll be like. So yeah, if I get that done quickly enough, I could move on to either recording backing vocals or recording the last electric guitar solo properly. Cause that's pretty much all I want to add to the song. I know it's no secret. I want you so bad I want you so bad I want you so bad Don't be that one my plan I won't change my plan I won't change my plan I won't change my plan and speaking of cool, this relays to... Relays? That's the right word for that. Relays. It's like a baton. Relay. To the topic I want to talk about. I am not cool. As I've been mentioning in these last couple of videos about um, not wanting to film the process if I don't have anything to say or I don't want to you know, put the carriage in front of the horse and like document something that I'm not actually doing at the moment. And I wanna make sure that the music comes first. Along those lines, me making these process videos and vlogs, I've mentioned this before, but it's not easy. As in, it, I would look a lot cooler if I didn't do it. And I feel like there might be a little bit of a perception that I do this because I think I'm cool and people are, should be interested in what I'm doing. And obviously there is an element of that. Everyone has to have that confidence and, and belief if you're an artist. You have to believe you have something worth saying, which I do feel like I do. But me doing it currently in my situation of not having a lot of listeners, you know, I have like about 30 views per video, maybe a lot lower sometimes. What would be smart for me to do if I wanted to perceive to be cool is to stop doing it. Don't put it out there. So I want to take the idea away that I do this because I think it's entertaining to, or not entertaining, it's that it's cool for me to do it. Like, I know basically most artists don't post what they going on because what they have going on because it isn't attractive you you don't have anything going on you live with your parents um your process is quite mundane and that's exactly why I'm showing this I'm not trying to act like I've got something cool going on behind the scenes that I don't like I'm being 100% real and honest and in the short term it actually kind of hinders the way that people see me like I don't I mean that's not for me to say, right? But I'm pretty sure there's a huge group. Not you people who watch. Like, if you watch consistently, I know that you understand me and support what I'm doing and understand my vision of sorts. But for the most part, I look like a guy who's talking about stuff and I'm not... I'm not... It's not like I got a big audience behind me 
to justify doing this. So long story short, usually this phase of someone's career, you don't want to be talking because you almost want to seem elusive and secretive and like, oh, what's he doing behind the scenes and what's his life really like? You know what my life is pretty much like. And I want it that way because the point of these videos and the point of what er most of what I do is to give myself. That's the job of an artist. And not all artists have to do it in the way that I'm doing it with the process, you know. I'm not saying that people have to do that, but for me, showing you the honest truth of my living situation, how I make things, is a form of artistry. And, um, and then obviously with the music too, like th these songs are very bare and very honest and that's what I feel like my job is here on earth and here currently is to give you, to, to give you me and not think about how it affects me so much. Obviously I have to try and make sure I keep, take care of myself, but that's my number one job and I really, really care about that. Now, with all that being said, I do love making videos and these videos in the short term also help me keep me accountable and keep me in check and it'll be cool to look back on and be like, hey, I was right. I said I was going to play at Danforth Music Hall. I said I was going to play arenas and I do. It's going to be awesome to do that, yes. But for the most part, the short term version of this doesn't look very attractive and it would be more effective for me to not show that and be more elusive because people would perceive me as something that I'm not. But again, that's dishonest and that's not what I'm about. Just a little rant, okay? I just felt the need to say this because it's like, it looks egotistical, a guy on a camera showing you their life. Like, I understand that. But it's not, for the most part, the case. I didn't take a breath there. Next video, I have to show you the album art. I got a new thing going on and I really like it. And record guitars on this song, move on to next songs. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to it. Thanks for being here, truly.